Hello YouTubers, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. In the last couple of months or so, um, I've made videos about Windows, guys. Um, and the Windows platform, I've been ranting and raging about the App Store. So it's been about a month since I revisited Windows, guys. So what I'm going to do today is I got my Android device and I'm going to revisit the App Store. What about the App Store? One of Windows Phone's biggest issue is the App Store. So today I'm going to explore the apps that's on my OnePlus 3 and see if the apps is on the Windows Store. So get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. So let's go ahead and explore the app store. One thing that I know uh, once you explore the app store is that um, I know that all the Google services is not going to be in the App Store. We already know this already. So we're going to skip that. Uh, some of the things that I look for is some of my business apps. Uh, and my business apps, the OneDrive, the Word, the PowerPoint, the Excel, yes, that is native to the Microsoft Store. So we already know that those apps are there. Uh, so one of the other apps that I'm looking for is Evernote. Right now, yes, Evernote is available uh, in the Windows Store. A lot of things I used to say a long time ago about the Windows platform is that the, the App Store had all the apps that I was looking for. Uh, and that's true. Uh, the apps that I was looking for back in the day was here. Now, some of the apps that left the App Store, such as PayPal, uh, and some of the banking apps that left the store, that had me concerned. Uh, so I'm going to back and revisit. Let's see if PayPal is back available in the store. Matter of fact, I already have PayPal downloaded uh, on my device, which this is the uh, 950 XL. Uh, and so let's see. See, PayPal is unavailable. So right now it is unavailable. But let's see if I, if I could download it again. Uh, unfortunately... Uh, it says, uh, unfortunately, you're no longer able to use PayPal. Uh, let's look at that there. Uh, so, th that's the thing, guys. So, the app has been removed from the App Store. Uh, but you can use the browser. Uh, but it's not a native app anymore in the App Store. So, PayPal is out. Uh, let's go to uh, Capital One. Right? So, Capital One is not uh, in the App Store. Let's go ahead and search uh, for Craigslist. And I think Craigslist is in the App Store. So we do have Craigslist app is available in the App Store. So uh, this, again, this is one of the apps I use. So we do have Craigslist here. And, uh, and I do use Patreon. Uh, so let's see if Patreon is in the App Store. Patreon, again, Patreon is not in the App Store, guys. So Patreon is not in the App Store. Uh, and let's go down and, and again, I use easy screen saver, uh, screen recorder. So AZ uh, screen recorder is not in the app store. Guys. And we're going to look for Dropbox. Uh, that's one of the other ones. I think Dropbox is here. All right. So boom, let's go to Dropbox, guys. All right, so Dropbox is here. So they do have a native app uh, of Dropbox in the App Store. So uh, overall in my business portion uh, of uh, the app, uh, they do not have PayPal. Um, they do not have the Rush Call. They do not have a Patreon AZ screen recorder. And I'm quite sure they have third party apps, all right? But these are the, the native apps that I use. And yes, they do have uh, Amazon. Uh, so those are some of the apps I already know that they have. All right, so let's get into um, let's get into the uh, games. All right, so let's get into the games. Uh, I did see Asphalt 8, so Asphalt 8 is in the App Store. Uh, one of the other games that I like is Nova 3. Uh, I mean, I really like Nova 3. One of my biggest games that I like. Uh, and uh, so yes, they do have Nova 3. All right, uh, Nova 3 is a $6.99 cost uh, for Nova 3. So, all right, so we know that game is there. All right, let's go on and, and take a peep at uh, my other game, which is Dead Trigger 2. So, Dead Trigger 2 is here. 
all right so we do have day trigger 2 on deck all right uh, just so you know yes the app is here all right so let's go to go to uh, modern combat 5 uh, and uh, go from there and I'm gonna tell you that MC5, I got MC4, but it's MC5 also. So Modern Combat 4 is here, all right? Uh, Modern Combat 5, I don't think it's here. But Modern Combat 4 is here. Uh, now, last time, one of my biggest gripes was Clash of Clans. And uh, last time I looked, I don't believe Clash of Clans is here, all right? Um, so no, it's not in, in the App Store. And this is another big gripe of mine. I've been playing Clash of Clans for over a year. Uh, it's on iOS and Android, it's not here. All right, so uh, recap it real quick. You do have Asphalt 8, you do have Nova 3, you do have Day Trigger, you do have Modern Combat 4. All right, you do not have Clash of Clans. All right, so uh, that's one of the things that, uh, you know, hey, that's that's a lot of apps that I use, so that's pretty cool. And, uh, and I do have Pandora in here, so, and they do have Pandora app, all right, and iHeartRadio. Uh, so that is some of the things that I use uh, here. Now, as far as uh, Pixie Pro, uh, I use that app a lot, actually. Uh, so I'm not sure Pixie Pro is going to be here. See, Pixie Pro is not here. Um, it is telling me it's misspelled, but uh, that's how, that's the spelling of it. And I could even go as far as uh, kind of break it up, you know, Pixie Pro. All right, so let's go to search there. And again, guys, it's not there. See, Pixie Pro is not here. Um, it is telling me it's misspelled, but uh, that's how that's the spelling of it. And I could even go as far as uh, kind of break it up, you know. Pixie Pro. All right, so let's go to search there. And again, guys, it's not there. All right, so uh, let's go to go into my social apps. All right, uh, which is a Telegram. I use Telegram a lot. Uh, we, that's where my VIPs at. All my VIPs. Uh, are in uh, telegram now we okay so we have telegram uh, messenger here uh, and actually they say I got it downloaded already all right so um, say let's let's launch it and uh, yeah so telegram is in the Windows Store there you go and go to Instagram all right so uh, one of the things that I actually saw this in the the front part of the app store was Instagram all right so um, so Instagram is six tag now uh, for what a lot of Windows users will tell you is that they will use six tag over Instagram but I believe this is the new update to Instagram so uh, the native app if you look at the icons of Instagram here and look at the icons there I uh, actually look the same except the color uh, so I think this is the native app of Instagram there all right, so we already know that uh, it, the App Store does not have Pokemon Go. I've made I, I made videos about this already, guys. I don't want to uh, beat a dead horse. So uh, yes, uh, it's not there. It's just not there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so it's not there. So we do have Vine. All right, and I'm typing in Twitter. And yes. Um, it does have the uh, native Twitter app also with Vine and stuff like that. So, yeah, the Twitter app is here. And, again, Facebook is here, guys. So, uh, and that is based, I look, I'm an easy user, all right? I don't have, I don't use a lot of apps, all right? So, uh, all the apps that I, I'm looking for, it's about 80% in the app store, all right? Uh, your mileage may vary. I know what a lot of people have been saying about the app store. Uh, it, it's that it's really bad. Not, you know, uh, they got all these third-party Pokemon apps that's popping up in the App Store. You know, I am not trying none of this stuff. If it's not the official app, I don't want it. I don't want a third-party Pokemon app, so I'm not even gonna make a video about it. Now they did have some uh, uh, some APKs and some side loading and stuff of the Pokemon Go app. But it's been updated and all those silo apps are not working anymore. So, uh, no, it's it's one of those things that, uh, no. Uh, but let's go on and explore the app store a little more here. So, you do have your, your Subway Surfer. You do have Candy Crush. 
Uh, you do have some of the apps like uh, Minecraft, Plants and Zombies, and stuff like that. So you do have some of those uh, apps there, and you do have Touchdown Heroes, uh, some of the, these apps that's popping up in the App Store, guys. And, and you know, the App Store have, have gotten a new look. Uh, and the, the new look has different categories and stuff like that. So uh, that's pretty neat. All right. Um, but overall, guys, I just want to kind of give you a, a video exploring uh, the app store and the app situation of the Microsoft store here, guys, the Microsoft platform. One of the biggest, biggest problems with Microsoft is the app store, right? Uh, but a lot of people have learned to live with it. Uh, but a lot of diehard people that need the apps uh, just can't live with it. And believe it or not, I'm one of them. Um, I mean, I really need the PayPal app. It worked flawlessly, then all of a sudden it went away. Uh, and all the business apps, uh, as far as PowerPoint and stuff like that, that I use for school and work, is still in the app store. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Get, leave your comment down below. Let me know what you think about the Microsoft and the Microsoft App Store. See you guys on the next video. Peace.